technology to sequence the release of hundreds of satellites started with the original idea of going back to the automotive market. It might seem completely different, and, and it is, right? A car is way different than a launch vehicle. But the idea of bringing up multiple airbags in response to a crash, the automotive industry started with frontal impact airbags, but then all of a sudden you had the proliferation of side impact airbags and knee airbags and seatbelt pretensioners. And so now all of a sudden you've got to control and sequence all these different pyrotechnic events. Well, that's really no different than releasing a bunch of satellites. And so the fact that Paxi EMC had some proprietary technology around doing that and then applying it to a different customer's need, that's, that's the real secret sauce of what we do. From that technology, we went over to the military side and in hypervelocity missiles, it was used to steer the missiles. So for example, in the PAC-3 missile, there's 180 rocket motors that steer that missile. So you have to sequence 180 different events. We've taken and grown that technology now to launch vehicles and payload release. So for OneWeb and the RUAG system, we are releasing up to 36 satellites. I think one of our largest successes was the first RUAG endeavor that we had. So we took on the responsibility to not only provide the initiator and the separation knot, but also the control system and the harnessing. We have been a long-standing energetics organization. Throughout the community and throughout their customer base, they know us as a very solid energetic supplier. What they didn't know us as is an electronics supplier. One of our growth initiatives is developing products that integrate electronics and the pyrotechnics together. For the smart initiator, there's two integral parts. Uh, we have a controller and we have the smart initiator. The smart initiator is the pyro actuating initiator and behind it we have the brains of the operation. The smart controller can control up to 32 different configurations. A couple initiators can be placed in one configuration so you can have multiple detonations with one control. With the smart controller though, you are able to deploy up to 70 satellites in space at uh, specific times and locations. We came up with the concept of a smart connector. So the smart connector can be something that you can put in line with any type of a device. So it will talk to the brains, it will have the electronics, and then it can talk to either a pyrotechnic device or even a non-pyrotechnic device. And we can put all these different initiation events, or you can think of them as actuation events, because there's all kinds of examples of electromagnetic or mechanical actuators, but we can put them on a network. And so the capability of putting these things on a network is pretty powerful for a customer, because then you can use the same command and control system for a pyrotechnic signal that you can use for any type of signal, any type of actuation device. It doesn't even have to be a PAXI device. All we need is that smart controller. And that was something that came out of our early prototyping capability. And we said, it doesn't have to have an explosive output. We can just have it as a communications node that's built into this overall actuation network.